Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Travis the Pop Tower coming in with a special video I am presenting. First off, I'd like to say that I am going through a 4th grade fad and of course judging by the way I'm wearing this special Pokemon League hat and I've discovered a plus size Pikachu here and it crept its on its own leg. Um, it's going full impulse and I'd like to share a couple items here which I was I'm right now on the quest in finding my lost Pokédex my the first one in the series that was really neat and helped me with a lot of homework assignments and apparently some kind of bug crawled up inside of it and died and on my trip into a really heavy toy box. I wish I could have filmed it, but because all I have here is a shitty mic, I wasn't able to present a video. Should have wished for a stand microphone for Christmas. But anyways, a couple things I did find on the way, what Pokemon related are, oh my god, I'm here. Not really all that special, but I found the instruction manual to the Pokemon trading card game. It's bent. It's got a whole bunch of stuff here. Pretty good condition, judging by how old it is and how long it was locked up. That was a purple Game Boy game. Is that Gary? The snail? Anyways, um, I found. Oh, well, this is interesting. Pokemon Valentine day cards. We have Teacher I Choose You, which was really creepy for something I would give my teacher, judging that most of them were male at the time. Friends Forever. Um, if I had given this to a girl, we all we should have known back then that it wasn't going to last by this time. Um, not a Friends Forever. And I Choose You. Play that to catch them throwing his balls. Not very appropriate for a Valentine's card, okay? And also, I found a couple of Pokemon figurines, surprisingly. Oops, and I apparently just knocked one down, excuse me. Here we go. Um, we have here Diglett. I'm surprised I'm doing this without my glasses. Licking Tongue. A oh that's a Kingler, that's not Krabby. Huh. I found this actually on the shelf over there. Well I found a lost long Robocop breastplate and his automatic gun. A Cubone and where'd he go? Replace with a Marowak. I got those right. And Diglett becoming Doug Trio here. I never understood why they look so mad. Probably because, like, I don't know. Looks like a little sausage link stuck in the ground. Who would like that? Okay, moving on to our next little item. We have here. I hope this mic is working. A couple of Pokemon trading cards. First, though, I'd like to take out the uh, collectible card, whatever that I found. I have it. I found a sleeve of recently. Found an Oddish card. It has a couple of fun facts on the back. Pokemon number and whatnot. Okay, a couple of old-fashioned trading cards. Oh no, I didn't. Oh no, I didn't. Oh no, I didn't. Okay, anyways. we have a dark. Psyduck, Charmander, a Psychic Energy, I'm needing really more energy, I only have five in my deck, Bulpex, a normal Psyduck, a Drowsy, Ugh, damn it, 
a dark gloom. Two Bulbathors. That's about it. And like I said before, I found a plush Pikachu in my sister's room and I don't know if she would like to part with it or not. It seems to have a little piece of paper sticking out from its ass. A little odd. Paper clean on I suppose. But anyways, I guess that is my Pokemon report for now. And this is me saying something really cheap and cruddy like I can't turn it with a pencil on. Shit now blanked out. Well anyway, just 